it to Mexico. Both of us have never been to Mexico before and it was actually really funny when me and Lewis first got together. We'd literally, no, we'd been seeing each other a week and he was like, I really want to go to Mexico with you. Three and a half years later, he's getting his dream. Yeah, we're at the airport ready to board. We've been up. We didn't go to sleep till like three in the morning um, because of the time difference. We wanted to stay up. So I've got my Jessica Chew tracksuit on, feeling dead comfy. We have got our beds and Lewis is not getting pissed. He thinks he is, but he's not. <laughs> oh, Potter, are you excited? Yeah, I'm excited. I'm going to go find Canelo and slap him up in his own backyard. Who's that? See how he feels about that. Who's that? Uh, just some, some guy. So we're excited, I'm guessing. Yeah. 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 I, I'm hoping we get there for a decent time and then I can trash you all the time until we go to sleep. Oh my god. Right, so me and Lewis she... have basically, Lewis was brushing his teeth for ages and I was like standing there, like, hurry up, hurry up. And then he came out and I was like, oh, they've done a final call. Of course, it was literally at the other end of the airport. We were like proper sprinting. I was like, oh, it's a final call. Like, don't stress too much. We get there. There's like no one there apart from people checking in. And they were like, um, you're not checked in. Like, you're not on this flight. And they're like, do you have your board and stuff? And we were like, yeah, like we've got all of our board and stuff. Like we've checked in our bags. And they were like, you've been unchecked from the flight. Like you're not on it anymore. So we literally just stood there for like 20 minutes not knowing if we were going to be able to get on the flight. We're the last people on the flight. Everyone's waiting for us because they'd unchecked us. On it, I'll, I'll, when I sit down, when I'm sat down, I'll tell you what my heart rate was at. My heart rate peaked at 171 <laughs> in that moment. Yeah. <laughs> you don't realise how stressful it was. So I genuinely, for a second, thought we weren't getting on the flight. So yeah. Like, Breathe, we're on it, we're on it, we're on it. Just about. <laughs> Without the help from fucking two of you unchecked us. Thanks, Jesus Tui. Christ. We are at the hotel. Uh, thank you. Hello. I got a drink. I didn't get one, she didn't like this. She knew that Lewis would just be a nightmare, that's why. Yeah, no. Checked into the room. This, I'll do a quick wee tour. This is a bathroom, really large shower, although not a very big shower head, which we're used to at home. Um, there's two sinks, me, just to show a it looking like a Y2K. And then just the bed, a nice big mirror for us to take photos in. And then the best part of it all is the woman kept asking us if it was our first time in Mexico and we said yeah. And we got a free room upgrade. It's like an ocean view. Like how incredible is that? It's like seven o'clock at night as well. So it's not even peak ocean time. But yeah, we are so excited now. We're really close to everything. Like the strip's literally about five minute walk away. And to be fair, coming in, apart from like, immigration stuff that you'd have to do it anyway they didn't check to see if we were vaccinated they didn't check like our plf form like nothing like that but i'm just so excited a well, quick turnaround we just unpacked it's gone dark now it's like 25 to 8 we've, we've not really had anything proper to eat so we're gonna have an explore of the hotel and get some food so straight into the food i've got lamb steak chips and Liz has got the same and a pint what sorry so we have had food earlier though like we're not just got this for in pal of the pair of us it's the second time round. yeah
And we're just having a little stroll around the beach. I think if you've watched my Fort Ventura vlog, which if you've not, go and watch it, um, you will see that we're not great fans of the beach, but it's so nice. Per white sand, blue sea. Yeah, it's beautiful. <laughs> it's just really nice. Um, so we thought we'd go in the morning before. Lewis is too drunk to walk. No, I'm not. Too drunk to walk, Were you not too drunk to walk properly last time? Yeah. Yeah. So uh, we don't want him having a tantrum again, basically. So yeah, lovely little walk. And then probably gonna do some Sunday then, then have some lunch. So I'm listening to a pod, and Liz is about to go play water polo. Hey, I'm play water polo. I'm gonna score some goals. I do it on the grass, and I'm about to do it in water. Star striker. I'm gonna go. I've been playing some water polo, which I was absolutely shite at, as you can imagine. But look what they've got. Legito in a coconut! I'm in heaven, I am in heaven. Not quickly, look at all these rose petals they've put down for us. How cute! Um, but we've just had a day around the pool. It's actually been so nice. Like, it's a really nice resort and I feel like all this stuff going on, I definitely recommend. I mean, if you wanna literally just lie by the pool and be silent from nine till five, then maybe it's not for you because there's a lot going on. But we kind of had that in Fort Ventura and this feels really different, which is quite nice. It's good that we've had both. But we're just going to have a look now around actual Cancun. I've heard a couple of people tell us not to walk and to get taxis, but we're literally around the corner from the strip and where everything's at. So we've just decided whilst it's still daylight to kind of get our bearings. Hello. Hello vlog. Okay. And just see where things are at really. So I'll show you. When we were driving here, like especially like Coco Bungalow, it just looks so cool. We're definitely going, I'm very excited about that. I'll show you what the strip looks like in daylight because I'm sure you'll see it at night time and it won't be a good representation. We have now just gone for, we had a look at like all the Coco Bongo stuff and it was really lively, like, proper and uh, gone for a little walk again on the beach it's just incredible Liz is also having a wee and that's Liz probably having a piss but I don't know if you can even really tell how nice it is okay let's go okay let's go when we last caught up we were on our little walk we came back got dressed ready for the evening meal and chocolate covered anything really it's actually really good as well like food wise i definitely think the evening meal is like the worst out the three but it's not bad but breakfast and lunch are actually really good they're like all inclusive so we're probably just gonna have food and then we're just staying in the hotel again tonight, so probably gonna just get involved with the entertainment, which was quite good last night actually, and have some more bed brush on. Going for round two.
me and Lewis couldn't remember going to bed last night, but we weren't even that drunk, we just couldn't remember going to bed. I feel like we've all been there before. And again, just gonna like chill around the pool again today, but I think we're gonna look at booking some excursions. I had people tell us it was really cheap and then when we've come here, we've like went to multiple places and it's been a bit more expensive than we thought. So we've just been like, do we go for the cheaper option or the more expensive? I think we've just decided we're gonna go for the more expensive because we're only here once and everyone's been given like good reviews about it. So I think we're gonna have a look today and book a couple and probably look at booking Coco Bongo as well. Um, shall I let you know how we get on with that? So, how cute is this little thing from Sheen, uh, Sheen? I thought it was really nice, it was only like eight pounds for the bikini and this, just large. Okay, so just an update for you all. We didn't end up booking any excursions yesterday. We got absolutely steam around the pool um came back to the room i think about half six and then i woke up at six this morning we literally just passed out didn't make our evening meal didn't go out just wasted a night but it's okay it was only a night time we didn't have anything planned so we're going to try book some excursions today I definitely won't be drinking as much because I was actually really sick um, and I don't really fancy doing that again. disco last night in our hotel which was actually really fun me and Lewis were both feeling a bit grim yesterday and we were like oh we're not gonna have a drink or not gonna drink that much so I think this girl came on and that all changed but we are now finally going to book some excursions it's now Sunday so we've got six nights left um so I think we're gonna go we're obviously gonna go coca bungles and then there's this thing called Explore that everyone's been telling us about that's really good. So we're going to do that and look at a snorkeling activity. Um, I'll let you know how much it all costs when we're done. Because I am going to try and get my haggle on. Um, my friend Fran's really good at barring, so I'm going to channel my inner Fran. That's the UK come all the way from the UK. Are you ready? Vale, se descansa así. Una, dos, let's go. Come on, dale. Stacky, stacky. Eso. Let's go, let's go. Eso. Dale, siguiente, siguiente. Yeah. Yeah. Close. Va, amigo. Go. Berlin, go. Berlin, go. Yeah. Yeah. So everybody, repeat after me, todo el mundo repitiendo después de mí. Y yo digo, I say, one, two, 
That one didn't even make it to the wall, sir. <laughs> that one's got that. The net's there. Ellie, Ellie, Ellie. Yeah, we're the prize, though. Let's give it up. Yesterday, we booked all of our excursions. As suspected, we did end up bartering them down. Uh, we got like $120 off our excursions. So if you're coming, bar people down because they will go down. We are going to Coca Bungos tonight, which I am so excited for. I've heard such good things. I don't really know what to expect, but I just know it's going to be good. I'm actually going to go down in 10 minutes, go to Coca Bongo, which I will film and then probably be hungover for the rest of tomorrow. I will take you to Coca Bongo's with me.